the United States quickly deployed warships to protect Israel and American forces after receiving a warning about a potential direct attack from Iran. U.S. officials took action to prevent a broader conflict in the Middle East, with the discussions between Army General Eric Carrilla and Israeli Defense Minister Yohav Gallant on how to respond to a possible Iranian attack. Two destroyers were repositioned, with one carrying a missile defense system. President Biden expressed concern about a potential Iranian strike on Israel, emphasizing U.S. support and defense of Israel. Israeli and U.S. military leaders strategized on readiness for an attack. Despite tensions, reassurances were given by U.S. Defense Secretary Lloyd Austin to aid Israel if attacked by Tehran. Iran's threats stem from a Damascus attack that killed a top Iranian military official, leading to heightened tensions in the region, the Wall Street Journal has reported. U.S. officials urged Israel to share information on potential responses to an Iranian strike to safeguard forces. Israeli Prime Minister Benjamin Netanyahu met with security officials to discuss readiness. In Tel Aviv, residents remained calm, with no changes to emergency instructions from Israel's home front command. Amid uncertainties, the sentiment of strength and resilience prevailed among the people.